Thank you. Well, the nation's oldest and most prestigious science and math competition for high school seniors has released its top scholars for 2024, and two of them are local. And joining us this morning is one of those talented students, Hari Shrikant from Mira Loma High School. Thanks for coming in today. Yeah, thank you, Deirdre. This is a really big deal. So you're one of 300 kids who got selected based on your STEM project. Yeah. Okay, your project name is Multimodal Computer Vision and Novel Reinforcement Learning for Robot Navigation and Fires. Yeah. What is it? So there's really two halves to what my project is, and like a simple overview of that is, it's a project designed to help firefighters locate and rescue inhabitants in trapped and burning buildings. So the first half of that is the perception challenge. So okay. uh, navigating and seeing obstacles and fires is a very big challenge for robotic systems just due to all the smoke, all the heat. So what I did was I developed a system that combined lasers with sonar and was able to kind of deal with uh, a very complex set of environment so that it could navigate and move through these buildings at a pretty high speed. So what attracted you to that? So uh, er, when I was uh, starting out high school, the Paradise and Caldor fires caused some people that I knew to have to leave their buildings. And I began seeing how big of an impact the fires could cause to the people around me. So that compelled me to start using my interest in robotics, which I had been building up you know, ever since I was young. I loved robotics, physics, math. And I started using that work. And I decided, OK, I'm going to put this to work. and create a solution that could hopefully help other people. Isn't that amazing when you see one of those like real world problems, you go, what could we do to make this better? So that's really cool. Yeah. So what, you got 300 kids who got this incredible honor, and in the next couple of weeks, they're gonna whittle that number down, and then what happens? Well, the top 40 finalists, which will be announced uh, January 24th, will be invited to the Regeneron Science Talent Search Summit in Washington, D.C., where over the course of the week, they'll present their work and research to leading scientists and roboticists worldwide so I you know I'm looking forward to seeing if I advance to that next round but it's a very great opportunity it's, it's a great opportunity and I work. think it comes with a little scholarship money too yeah right? um, there's a scholarship that uh, I've received right now both m me and my school have received scholarship money to put towards use in STEM and the finalists and the winners will receive even more to hopefully take their project and uh, advance it to the next level. That's super exciting. Okay, so in the middle of all that, he was also doing all of his college apps because he's a senior. So it's been a very, very busy year, but we wish you the best of luck. And thank you for coming in. And I really appreciate that you can break it down into ways that's really understandable because yeah. that also is a gift too. Yeah, thank you, Deirdre. All right, thanks. Good luck to you.